All right, day three, we're off on the trail again. We're kind of off trail, making our way to Betsy Lake. We're gonna fish some of these lakes along this trail and see where we go from there. Hopefully we can. Oh, there's fish spawning right there. Big one too. Huh, anyway, we're gonna have a good day of fishing. All right, there's number 11 and 12. The other one I didn't get on film, but here's number 12. All right, let's let you be free. Yeah, we found Giardia water right there. Heck yeah. Don't drink that. Way goes sometimes. Bear crap. Well, out of my decades of coming to the Uinas, I can't say I've ever seen a bear up here, ever, anywhere. But some bear scat right there. So they are here. Just never seen one. All right, there's Miles out there fishing the island peninsula thing. This Grand Ida Lake is big. And that just might be Granddaddy Mountain. There ain't no might about it, it is. But look at how big this lake is. <clears throat> That's just the part you can see from where I'm standing. Check that out. When I came up through those trees right there, and it took off. There's a little nest in there of eggs. Huh, pretty cool. Man, this is a pretty lake, isn't it? It is. I didn't realize how big it is. It's huge. I'm waiting for you to hook one up. I got you on film. Uh, I'm going to hook a rock up here pretty soon. Drag it on the bottom so it looks like you have a hit on your pole. No. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't have that many jakes left to lose. Yeah. Well, you can go in after them. Yeah. <clears throat> All right, let's see what Miles is doing over here. Well, I just found him a nice sunny spot to fish. Okay. Yeah, it looks like Miles found himself a nice chair tree. Uh -huh. Oh, look at that. He's got the tuna fish burrito. Yep. Heck yeah, I'm going to have a spam tilla. It's lunchtime. All right, I got one. Broke the spell of Granddaddy Lake. Holy cow, finally get nice cutthroat. Beautiful. Get you back in the water. taking this trail down to Lodgepole Lake. It's a pretty significant drop from Granddaddy down to Lodgepole. Pretty decent trail though. Follows the river and the waterfall. Super pretty. 
Hopefully Lodge Pole will be better to us than Granddaddy was this time. All right, we made it to Lodge Pole Lake. This better yield a trout for Craig, or he's not gonna be happy. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Miles decided to try this frog pond over here, and bam, he's hooked up. Yeah, it's not a big spider, though. <laughs> Still a fish. Look at that. Heck yeah. Good job, buddy. Hey. A little cutthroat? Um, Maybe. No. Ah, a little, little brook trout. Right on. Hold her up. Heck yeah. Nice. Nice little brook. All right, Miles is hooked up too. Heck yeah. Oh, dude. Gotta pull him no. through. Let him swim out of it and then pull him yeah, through. Okay, okay. No, did he get off? Wait, uh, dang it. Oh, he got off. He got off. Well, at least he didn't get snagged. Heck yeah, that's five for five casts so far. This is a hopping little pond. All right, I'm hooked up again. Get him through the reeds. Through the lilies. Come on, through the lilies. Come on, you can do it. Dodging lilies. Got one? Got another one. Woohoo! Slow down there, buddy. He's a little guy, but. Ouch! Still, still counts. All right, Miles just got hooked up. Oh, there's deer running through there too. Over there. I don't know if they'll come through again. All right, good job, Miles. All right, hooked up again. Hooked up again. Mine's, mine's caught in the lilies. I might have to go in after it. Meanwhile, on the other edge of the pond, Miles has got one too. Oh, got a tag already. Oh, got him! <laughs> Heck yeah! Man, I love this pond. Well, he's bigger than the rest I've had so far. Not too bad. Come on. Heck yeah. Yep. All right, I'm hooked up again. Come on, come to Papa. <laughs> this lake is on fire. Come on. Oh, you're gonna fight right till the end. Heck yeah. Easy, easy. Seems like they're getting smaller. <laughs> All right, let them go, let them grow is what uh, Deepak says. Miles got one too. Get on over here to Miles. Voila. Okay, hooked up again. Come on, pole bender. Here's a pole bender. <laughs> Don't let him take you through the reeds. Oh yeah, I'm bringing him home. Oh yeah, I'm bringing in a water skier here. Bringing him in so fast. 
Heck yeah, right there. Shorebound. Man, he's doing acrobats. Come on, easy, easy. Get you back in the water. Woohoo! All right, Miles got another one. Heck yeah! Woohoo! All right. Well, Miles was waiting for my slow butt. I told him to go try this frog pond, and man, we lit him up. We, between the two of us, we caught like nine. Yeah, <laughs> it's pretty sweet. Heck yeah. So, if it doesn't look like it's much, try it anyway. Just might get lucky. Hey, check out that. A little makeshift lean-to cabin of sorts. Anything it says on there? Area closed restoration or something. No camping. I don't want people camping in it. Okay, that's cool. Here, look at the fresh growth on the pine right there. Super cool. All right, I'm hooked up. I went out. I had to go out in the water and retrieve my lure. And while I was out there, I cast it and hooked one up. I was wanting trout for dinner, so by golly, I'm going to keep this one. All right, hooked up again. might be big enough for dinner. I don't know, we'll see. Not a bad little brookie, but I think I'm going to let him go. I can hook it up again. Maybe this guy will be a little bigger. Slugger. Come on. All right, so I like had to go to the bathroom and I was like, I got time for one more cast and the miles. He's like, oh, I can't <laughs> wait. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah, it's true. It's a true story. <laughs> I barely made it <laughs> to a rock. <laughs> that equals diehard fisherman. Casting well, you have to go to the bathroom. 21 fish on this trip. How about you guys? 15. 15 for Miles? 13. 13 for Nate? 13. 13 for Craig. Right on. That's a lot of fish. What's that, 62? Yeah, but mine were the biggest, so size matters. <laughs> That's a fish story. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so after four days, our little refrigerator here is still here, but it's half as big as it was before, so this snow is melting off quick. But it was nice having ice cold Coke Zero on this trip. It was awesome. All right, we found one of these under one of our tents. Uh, it's just a courtesy notice from the Forest Service letting us know we had a nice camp well away from the lakes and other water sources. Campsites are prohibited within a quarter mile of lakes in this area. Please scatter the ashes and disassemble the fire ring before you leave and please do not bury trash or burn trash so enjoy your stay so it's not a ticket but it's just kind of a friendly reminder of the rules in this area so we did just that we scattered the ashes and dismantled the fire ring as directed um, we are well away from the, the lakes as far as we could get so we felt like we were in compliance there as best as we could get in the location we were so 
Anyway, just a reminder of the rules in the area when you're in the Uinas. All right, we gave our uh, we gave our campsite a once over. Picked up all the miscellaneous trash laying around everywhere um, from the previous groups that were here. We dismantled the fire ring, scattered the ashes like they asked us to in that little note. And uh, I can tell that this is an established camp. People have been camping here for years, but we did what they asked anyway. And uh, anyway, looks like uh, better than we found it. And we're on the downhill descent close to the trailhead, so cold drinks in the cooler. Gotta love that. Great way to celebrate a successful trip. Made it. We made it. High five. Right on. How was your first backpacking trip being an Achilles? How about a high five? Check it out. Woohoo! Hey, hey. Makes it. I'm not, I'm not a, a cripple. <laughs> yeah, that makes it. You'll be able to do 10 miles instead of 5. Well, alright. Finished our hike. Of course, you gotta have uh, some cold ones on ice when you get done. It looks like the ice is melted, but ooh, it's still cold. Yeah, Viva Coke Zero and Viva Root Beer. And successful high five. What? A, a wet high five. <laughs> right on. It's an awesome trip. Look at that cooler full of goodies. Holy cow, that makes me look like kind of wimpy. <laughs> oh yeah. Mountain Dew. We are in the mountains, so that's appropriate.